What is going on, everybody? Welcome to BG EV. My name is Austin. And my name is Joan. And we typically do a EV reviews on specific vehicles. Yep. And yesterday we were doing one on the Ionic 5, and it actually brought up an interesting question if we were to compare Ionic 5 versus the Tesla Model 3. Yep. So today what Joan and I are going to be doing is we have 10 quick fire facts about each vehicle and we give you guys some information to make your decision a little bit easier if you're deciding between which base vehicle to go with. So right. Joan, yes. question number one. Okay. What is your base price? On the Model 3 dual motor, Yep. $57,900. On this one, this is single motor, rear wheel drive is 44000 Okay. Number two. Okay. What is your federal incentive? Zero. <laughs> I don't know why he's <laughs> Seventy-five hundred dollars federal incentive on this one. Okay, you got me there. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. All right. No, question number three. All right. What is your MPGE? MPGE. It's number three on your sheet. Is one hundred and thirty-four. Okay. City. Okay. Okay. Yours. Uh, mine's one thirty-two. Okay, so highway 116, no, 126, 98. Okay, combined, combined 131, 114. Ah, so you win that one. What's your range? 334 miles, 303. Okay, so you win on that one. Yeah, what's your warranty? Four year, 50,000 mile basic. Okay, but the, the battery is eight years, five year uh, powertrain. Five year, sixty thousand basic, mm -hmm. and then ten year, hundred thousand powertrain. That's a good warranty, I have to say. Okay. Charging stations. Mm. Tesla supercharging stations. Yep. Are are pretty vast in comparison to non Tesla. Yes. I agree with you. Tesla yes. superchargers have that on lockdown yes. completely. Yes. 100%. This, I cannot use Tesla charging stations. And to our question number seven, your yeah. time to charge. What's your time to charge on the Tesla Model 3? Well, that's a 240 volt charger. Yep. Is 11 and a half hours. Okay. It's like me plugging it in at home. At home. And just overnight. This one, 200 volt, same charger, uh, is eight and a half hours. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. What about with 350 kilowatt? DC charger, fast charger. Supercharger? Yep. I can go from 2% to 80% in 28 minutes. So this one is 10% to 80% in 18 minutes. But where's the supercharger? I win. On your house? Anyways, no, interior okay. space. <laughs> interior space. <laughs> 97 cubic feet. Oh, 106. I win. Um, does yours have Apple CarPlay or Android Auto? No, it does not. But does yours have karaoke? Your ADD is terrible. This has Android Auto and has Apple CarPlay. It is wired only. And does yours You fart? can put it in your <laughs> <laughs> You can put Apple Apple CarPlay and Apple or I'm sorry, Android in yours, but you have to buy an adapter. Mm. Okay. This has a standard. Okay. No, it does not mm. fart. <laughs> and no, it doesn't have karaoke. Well, there you go. And what would you rate the transition from a internal combustion engine mm -hmm. to an electric vehicle on a one to 10? So one being supremely easy, 10 being supremely hard. What number would you put it at? Okay, so the transition is, the, is probably the biggest differential, okay? Because getting in there, maneuvering through all the controls very similar to a regular car okay when you get into a tesla you're then dealing with a like a laptop a, a computer screen and everything is on the screen and you have to spend some time and learn it two completely different ways of driving from yeah. zero to a 10 scale yeah. 10 being the most difficult vehicle ever one being supremely easy yeah. you'd put this in the two yeah. I actually would rate it at a two as well. Yeah. On the Tesla, I would yeah. put it probably around an eight. Um, this one's a little bit more difficult yeah. and I agree with a lot of your points that you're saying. Yeah, and I think you just have to get used to it. You gotta spend the time, play around with it, watch the videos. It's a completely different feel. 
It really is. So, we hope this guy, this helps you guys out. Uh, we figured it was kind of a cool conversation while again, while we were doing this, um, and it brought up a lot of the cool questions and a little bit of uh, concerns we were looking for some answers. So um, don't forget to like the channel, um, throw us a subscribe as well. And if you have any other additional questions or if there's vehicles that we have not done yet and you guys are looking for that as well, please make sure to put that in the comments. So we hope this helps everybody. Ciao. Time to go to the beach. <laughs>